Now, going over to the Culture Prime podcast, you have Rosie O'Donnell calling Elon Musk creepy. The, uh, has to be the ultimate example of the pot calling the kettle black. Because, uh, yeah, Rosie O'Donnell is, uh, he's gone downhill like the quality of a Boeing airplane. Which, actually, no, that's a bad metaphor because Boeing airplanes used to be robust, great military vehicles, very reliable. He's gone down. will be a more, more apt metaphor for this situation. Hmm, perhaps the 2001 Dodge Grand, Dodge Grand Caravan, which started off moderately reliable and having some paint, but within a couple of years of living in the Midwest, presumably, you know, broke down, having more and more rust on it, more and more piece of metal flaking off, and reliability basically to nothing. Yeah, the old Dodge Grand, Grand Caravan is uh, not missed, but I partially digress. This comes to us thanks to Ian Miles Chong over in the good old X Twitter, saying, quote, Rizzo Donald says Elon Musk is creepy, um, has she looked at herself in a mirror lately? Which, uh, those glasses aren't helping. I mean, the glasses are as thick as a 2 by 4 And, I mean, I'm no artist, but I could have designed something better with crayon. It's, uh, it's not, it, I, I'm sorry, I should put a visual disclaimer in the show. I, if you're watching on good old Rumble or YouTube, you are now looking at a picture of Rosie O'Donnell in what looks, to, looks like to be a rudimentary black uh, t-shirt. Thankfully, uh, we don't see it in her entire body. You see mainly her face, which is still, I understand. I will try to do better in that regard. If you're tuning in on something like, you know, Spotify or Apple Podcast, you are spared this visual, um, this visual effect. Not that too much further ado. Let's see what Rosie has to say. Certainly is. So I think I told you in the last TikTok, or maybe I didn't, that I signed off of Twitter X. Because once he took over, I wasn't doing anything on there anyway. But then I thought, why am I leaving it up, right? So I deleted it for one year. And then after one year, you know, you could go back if you want. But I'm not going back. I really do not enjoy Elon Musk at all. He's creepy to me. There, I said it. There, I said it. Okay, hold, please. Let me check. Certainly is. So I think I told you in the last TikTok. Oh, come on, Elon. Well, maybe I didn't. Why did the videos auto automatically restart? I don't know if the if the joke in IT is it's not a it's not a it's not a bug. It's a feature. Now, it went about really well. I got two hundred fifty thousand views and eight nine point three thousand likes. And uh, yeah, how she is. I mean, of all the things Donald Trump called in terms of being a right call, yeah, yeah, he was a uh, he's calling Donald Trump as a eh, pretty on point. Now, some of the top comments coming from Elon Musk himself, who simply just had the lack of emoji, and he got 1.4 thousand likes. He also have a picture of what looks like to be some overweight dude exiting a cave, and it's from Freaky Squid saying, dude is weird, and it says Rosie O'Donnell came out of her den, and she saw her shadow, which means former years Trump, in 238 likes. DSS says, wait, are you sure that's Rosie? It looks like Keith Olbermann, in 164 likes. John simply says, Rosie O'Donnell calling anyone creepy is rich coming from her. Elon is changing the game while she is stuck in the past, getting 225 likes. Old School A says, Jealousy is ugly. <laughs> Just look at her face. Unquote. Getting 160 likes. Joey says, Liberal women say the most insane things. Getting 72 likes. Dickball says, She hates men, especially successful men. Getting 88 likes. Let's see. Common Sense Todd says, Rosie O'Donnell reminds me of a male version of Keith Olbermann. Getting 28 likes as well. MC says, has a picture of a, what is it, MTC person with the blue hair, the stubble in the face. And he says, uh, conservatives are weird, getting six likes. Betsy says, Elon doesn't want to date you, Rosie O'Donnell, getting 18 likes. The friends or meme says, nasty woman, getting 50 likes. And I, I should, let's be honest, when you, see, when you hear that phrase, you know, it's, you, you, you hear it in Trump's voice. So let me do my futile attempt. Ugly woman, Rosie O'Donnell. Only call her Rosie O'Donnell pig, not other women. She's barely a woman. As not the worst Trump impression, debatably, today. But let me know. Let's see. Drunk Pelosi says, I know and Vance is creepy is creepy of these two. There's a picture of uh Vance being in a marine uniform, and then Tim Walls after DUI, getting a mugshot, getting 33 likes. Oh jeez. Festivus 96 has a picture of Kyle's cousin from South Park. And he's got 19 likes. Uh I was gonna say the result is uncanny. So yeah, she used to be you know a big star on the TV. I mean, everyone watched her show. People tuned in. Many people enjoyed. Her, oh, people enjoyed her content. 
Uh, but yeah, she she's still culturally irrelevant. I don't even know what she's doing these days. And are you a longtime fan of Rosie O'Donnell? Does this change your perception of her? Let me know in the comments because, as always, it's going to be fascinating to hear what you have to say. Thank you, everyone, for taking the time to tune in. Again, try to get to 4,000 subscribers by the end of the month. So if you can click that button, I'd greatly appreciate it. Also, give me a thumbs up, thumbs down, or comment. It's a great way to give me some additional feedback, letting me know how I can show better and better. Lastly, don't forget to take time to tell your family, tell your friends, tell your coworkers, heck, tell your enemies, tell anyone and everyone. Just stay safe, fight the good fight.